From the University of Nairobi, I have Dr. Joyce Otieno and Dr. Megosi Karibunisana. Thank, Thank you. Sana. And just to get into details of what you do at the university, at uh, Tanzania, ladies first. Is that okay <laughs> with you, Dr. Ali? <laughs> okay. Thank you. As we have been told, I'm uh, Dr. Joyce Otieno. I work at the University of Nairobi, Faculty of Education, but I'm a member of Victimology. It's a worldwide organization that uh, looks at victims of crime mm -hmm. and uh, other calamities. Uh -huh. And that's why I'm here. Great. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Dr. Migosi. Yeah, my name is uh, Dr. Migosi Joash, and uh, thank you very much for having us here today. Uh, to share experiences on uh, victimology, the conference that is coming starting next week. Great. Uh, Maybe we could start with the basics of what that is for anyone who's hearing that word for the very first time. Anyone can go. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, victimology is, uh, is, uh, is one of the conferences of the University of Nairobi. Okay. The, the University of Nairobi has conferences that run every year, every year, in the month of October, November. So victimology is one of the conferences. Mm -hmm. Victimology is a conference about the, the victims. It's concerned about the victims. In the world in which we live here today, uh, we have got so many people who are affected by various issues, mm -hmm. either as an individual person or as a community. Uh, abused in one way or the other, those are the victims we are talking about. Mm -hmm. So this conference is about these victims, the people who have been abused over the years. Okay. Yeah, so... And what, what, what is the conference doing? What is it saying about the victims? Why is there a need to have a conversation? What is it that they observed in society, not just locally but globally, that uh, created a concern, a need to have this conversation? Okay, victimology, uh, as a, it's a, we can call it uh, the new baby in yes. the block. Yes. Because uh, it was after the Second World War that one of the lawyers observed his victims and realized that uh, human beings go beyond what has been done to them and who is the perpetrator. So he said that uh, there's need to have a, a discipline that actually this uh, uh, victimology is a, a sub-branch of criminology. Yes. Yeah. So, but now uh, criminology, we look at the crime and the perpetrators. Yes. Victimology, we look at the victim and where they're coming from. So after Second World War, mm -hmm. uh, Benjamin, uh, the second name is a bit tongue twisting. Yes. Benjamin c came up and said that we need to have a, a discipline. So it's an applied discipline that looks at the victims, what they've gone through in debt. Not just the victim alone, but also the criminal, the crime and all that, like uh, what we've just heard. Fanuel was telling us. Yeah. Yeah. What what led to it, and what is this relationship with the with the with the, cri with the criminal mm. uh, that could have led to all this? So it goes beyond what has been done to what are you feeling, where are you coming from, and what what can we do? That's what we talk about victim victim support. Okay. Yeah. So when we talk about victim support, what what entails that? The the support towards the victims. Mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. see, the key thing is about awareness. Yes. Because, uh, for example, in the Kenya where we are today, there are so many people who suffer in, in silence, as true. it were. They, they are suffering, they do not know what they are supposed to, to, to do. Mm -hmm. and therefore, the, this one is a bit to open up and to show them that there is a solution, there is a way you can be able to open up uh, so that your issues can be discussed, your issues can be seen. So, this yeah. is that, so th that's about the being open. About what is happening, awareness. because most yes. of the times, uh, we'll, we'll, let's pick a basic example mm -hmm. that uh, we've seen over the years, mm -hmm. where a lady will go in to say they had been raped, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and uh, probably even the rapist has been found. Mm -hmm. But then again, you will be questioned on how are you, where were you, what mm -hmm. were you dressing, yes. and those things. Mm -hmm. yes. So as a victim, you also feel like if that happened to Carol, then me as Mikali, I can't go reporting because if I go reporting, then they will not take me as seriously as I would like to be taken. Exactly. So it's listening to me as a victim away from the crime, mm -hmm. what it is that I am going through at the time. Yeah, so that's where victimology support comes mm. in. That uh, we want to create awareness through these conferences and workshops. Okay. That when you are a victim, uh, there's a way you, that you can uh, get support. There's protection, like uh, the act. Yes. Mm -hmm. Victim Protection Act, you mm -hmm. can, uh, th we have a, a whole body that deals with that. Mm -hmm. So we want to let people know that when you are a victim, mm -hmm. you can be helped, 
there's a, a constitutional body in Kenya that deals with that, that can come in, help you, support you, work with you, and can protect you when you have your rights from the media, from the society, that they don't need, not, need to, uh, not everyone needs to know that I was raped. Yes. But there are people who need to know, people who can empathize, sympathize, and then help me come out, that, out of that hole mm. to be where I'm supposed to be in the society. And that's what we want to shout out there in these conferences. And that's the University of Nairobi, this is the fourth conference. They bring in lawyers, psychologists, mm. social workers, mm educational uh, professionals mm -hmm. it, because it's a cross-cutting uh, kind of discipline okay. that these people can support these victims I can tell them hey there's help out here don't yes. die alone and that's what we are all about I think that's an important conversation because most of the times we cover and we do not know probably mm. because there's no one uh, like uh, the two doctors who are here who are being mm. loud about it and mm -hmm. being hard mm -hmm. because honestly I think th when I was doing research on this that's the first time I came about the act that actually there's something 2014 yes 24 we're in 2021 <laughs> yeah. that's yeah. about six years yes. Line. yes yeah and there's a, a, bo a board uh -huh. there's a board that has a, a fund approved by parliament a by fund parliament yeah to take care of me as to a victim take care of the victims yes yes yeah and we want them to know that's why we are shouting we're having workshops and conferences that they can know that when I've been harmed, like not just a rape victim, no. it's not just that. Yeah. Like uh, in this conference, we are having papers, people don't talk about even uh, COVID-19 mm -hmm. victims. Mm -hmm. uh, education was rolled out. Yes. Uh, people went online. What about the victims of poverty? Where were they? Were they online? Were they on TV, watching TV? <coughs> if uh, you are somewhere in the arid Asal region, and the government is rolling out TV programs, mm -hmm. people are being taught, and uh, kids, uh, your cl classmates somewhere are listening. We are going to do same class eight exams, same form four exams. Those are victims. So victimology mm -hmm. goes also beyond the crime that yes. we talk about. Yes. We have victims of society who are victims of poverty. Yeah. So, so we want to tell them, hey, there's a law in Kenya that you have a right to education. So when they're rolling out, how else can they package yeah. education to reach you when you don't have TV mm. and you don't have uh, internet? Computer, to, yeah. internet, all of that. Because yeah. now the education system has totally changed. Yeah, so. And uh, so when I look back, <laughs> the, I, I don't know if it's enough, the board, and this I'm asking as a kawaida monanchi, mm -hmm. that if this board <coughs> and the fans that have been given and this act that was put in place, is it functional? Is it, do people get help? Because when I look back, we had uh, post-election violence mm -hmm. and we had so many people who were misplaced, who lost property, who lost things. So there's a lot of, when, when we widen the scope, does the government, ha, victims? Oh, okay. Is there a way, is it. there a way to just, mm -hmm. you know, know that this tunaeza beba hii, yeah, to baby? Yeah, I think that it uh, comes into the purview <coughs> of the legal <coughs> of, <coughs> of the legal fraternity in Kenya. Okay. But as from <coughs> we are playing a small part from the academic point of it's, view. It's <coughs> small but very big. Yes. It's a huge yes, part. Yes, yes, from the academic point mm, of view. And that's mm. why we're here today. Okay, to, okay. To demonstrate, to show, mm. to create that particular awareness. And yeah. to rise up uh, so that any other person who is... Uh, in, engaged in this so that it can be able to wake up. Okay. In fact, the judiciary has been very active with us. For example, last year, <coughs> Justice Odunga was our guest of honor, and he gave very elaborate views of the, of the judiciary about those bodies, the government, the concerns, yes. and so on, about uh, these issues. Okay. So if we continue to repeat these issues and bring them out... Then somebody uh, will hear us. Yes, somebody will hear us. Even, those, institu even those institutions which are quiet, yes. those institutions which are charged with these responsibilities, mm -hmm. they will have to come up mm -hmm. and, uh, and, uh, and make their contribution known. Okay. So us as the universities to create that particular awareness and to bring all these players uh, so that they can be able to see, to, to be exposed and uh, so that they can be able to, to, to share and tell Kenyans what they I can't wait to are. see the day. <coughs> okay, Mukali, you asked a very important question. Yes. Can the government carry all of us? Can they? They can't. Okay. But now what, what, what we are doing actually is to let the victim know that the person who has come to take your property because of election violence, yes. if you know the person, the government has your back. Okay. Okay. And the person can be made 
to pay you what they have done. Mm. So the government doesn't have to carry all of us, but yes. I'm a victim now, they are giving me handout. Yeah. So we call this idea, mm -hmm. no, 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 that's not what we are all about. Yes. We just want to tell them that when I come to burn your house, you are a victim. If you know the person who did it, you have protection, Victim Protection Act, and you are protected. Mm. They can move you out of that vicinity, mm -hmm. take you somewhere where they, not can, they cannot reach you, they'll okay. deal with the situation, then you can be settled. Absolutely. We are telling them that, we, are telling we want them to know. Mm. But from academic yes. point of view, Great. not a legal point of view. Asante, mm. thank you. <laughs> at least mm. that's clear. Yeah. Uh, but let's talk about the research trip that is happening at the uh, UON. Mm. Uh, maybe you can tell us a bit more about that and how people can attend. Is it open to everyone? Yeah, 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 yeah. The <laughs> conference, the conference. There, are, there are about uh, six conferences which six are coming conferences. up okay. on Monday, on uh, Monday to, to Friday next week. Okay. <coughs> yeah, but uh, maybe before I go into that, yes, it's important to point out about the uh, victimology conference, which is starting on Monday, Monday and Tuesday. This is next week. On yes, Monday. yes, 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 mm yes. -hmm. We are doing this one in partnership with uh, Almadu Bello University in Nigeria, mm -hmm. uh, Kibabi University, African Women Development uh, Network. That is what we call the FemNet. We're also doing it to the probation, uh, mm. the, the Kenya probation uh, ministry in charge of uh, probation. We're also doing in uh, collaboration with the World Victimology Society. So there are many organizations which are sponsoring this uh, victimology we are coming up together with uh, for this one here on, uh, on Monday. So um, if you want to register for this particular conference, you can be able to, to go into the University of Nairobi website, mm. which is www. Dot unbi dot ac dot ke. Just say that again. Uh, www. Uh, yeah, those ones they know. The young people know how to. Dot unbi. <coughs> dot ac dot ke. Okay. Or you just Google University of Nairobi. Yes. Then it will take you to the page of the University of Nairobi. Mm -hmm. Then you will see that one for the conf uh, the conferences. Mm -hmm. Then you click, you register yourself, and then you attend. By the way, it is going to be virtual. And everybody is welcome. There's room for everybody uh, to take part in the conference in the victimology one. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Did you want to add something? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, the the variety, depending on your interest. Okay. The school of business is having theirs. Mm -hmm. School of law. Uh, so you don't have to come to victimology, but uh, I'm advocating because we all uh, we are all human beings. Yes. We want to know our rights. We want to support our people in the society. Yeah. We want a good society. Mm. And we won't want my neighbor suffering there when I can't help. So you can register for any of them, but I welcome you all to victimology. <laughs> we will be there. We will be there. Do yeah. we pay to be a part of this conference? If you're not presenting a paper, mm -hmm. you don't have to pay. Oh, wow. Isn't it? Is that true? No, I think there is something smaller. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but for those presenting, uh, for those presenting, uh, they pay. They pay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. And yeah, and I think there is uh, something very important that I had forgotten to say, yes. especially about the victimology. Mm -hmm. We're yes. also working alongside with the Longhorn publishers, mm -hmm. uh, so that all the papers which are going to be presented during the conference yes. are going to be published. Oh. Yeah, you see, publication in the university environment is very critical. Yes. Mm -hmm. So all the papers which are going to be uh, to be presented during the conference are going to be published by the Longhorn publishers okay. uh, in an article form, in a book form, kind of. Mm. Yeah. So that is a very critical aspect of the of the conference. And also. in the words <coughs> of our VC, so this is bringing together like-minded people, so that uh, they can share their research. Mm. And you know, when you when you research and you keep it, mm -hmm. it doesn't help anybody. So we want it published so that uh, it can be out there. People can know that uh, University of Nairobi is an institution that does research. Yes. Mm. This is what we have done. Yes. So what can you pick from it to take further? Mm. What can you implement okay. out of this? Yeah. And this means it doesn't matter where you are at in the world. You can no, be no. a part of the you conversation. Can of the conversation. You can <laughs> learn from whatever is going to be happening. And it's open to the public. Yeah. All you need to do is... You are Mesema Refu, but Nairobi University, when you Google that, then you'll be able to just be directed there and yeah. find out how you can be a part of this. Yeah, just find out about Research Week. And yes. It will give you the conferences available. Mm -hmm. Then you can have your pick. Yes. Okay. This yeah. is the front page mm -hmm. of the website. Okay. So yeah. it's very, very convenient. Yes, yeah. very convenient. Because it's, it's new, it's, it's trending. fresh. It's mm -hmm. trending right yeah. now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, what will be your parting shot as we come to the end of this conversation? You start with me? Yes, please. Okay, I would like to let people know 
that victimology is an applied uh, area of study. Anybody can be a victimologist. Uh, you don't need to suffer. There are people out there who can help you, can hold your hand. We have victim support. The government has a whole section, uh, a whole act about it. So reach out. Okay. Reach out to be helped. Absolutely. Thank you so much, Dr. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, thank you very much, Mikali, for having us here in the studios today. Yes. Yeah, the key thing is that uh, victims of any nature, uh, whichever way you are, there's a way out. As long as you come out, you, you, you talk your issues, you share with others, uh, there's a way that can be found uh, for you as a victim of any kind. Speak up. Yes, yeah. speak up. Mm. Asante Nisana mm. yes. for joining us today. Mm. And like I told you before we went on air, I was going to be a kawaida monanchi and ask because honestly, I did not know some of the things that you put out today. Mm -hmm. So to Milan, Pamoja, Thank now my you. audience. We're going to take a very short commercial break. We will be right back. This is Full Circle with Mikali. Thank you.